Hello everybody, welcome to Digital Painting and Photography channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful Little Island, Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I made this image a couple days ago, being image creator, based on Dali 3, right? Okay, this is my subject today, original image, then I expand so much. Actually though, I made this image to this, expand. Nice, well, nice atmosphere, I think. From here to this. Nice feeling outside, right? Okay, this is my base image. Then I made line drawing type image from this. Change blend mode to pin light. Half tone. Yeah, about this. 44. Half tone. Then uh, duplicate generative image. Change blend mode to color to add this much. Then add overlay effect over this to get so much contrast. Nice color, nice contrast. Touch, maybe too much contrast. But I'm gonna add white layer over this image, so just leave it this right now. This is, this is my same method so far. I did Pretty interesting method yesterday and different color layer so I want to try again just make it nice interesting image by my intuition I think yeah let's see just add white layer over this first fill this layer with white then I duplicate line drawing type image already. This one, darken max. Okay, okay, add mask over this white layer. Now, reveal this white layer. I want to use, I used evolve yesterday, then uh, show pretty interesting image. Today, I want to change brush to painting to turpentine. Okay, then let's see, reveal this, yeah? Here's this brush texture, pretty interesting. Movement. Okay, now. This time though, we got the nice background colors, so I want to tone down this white layer opacity to... Okay, now just leave it this, about 60 to 70, 67, yeah, so we see the background as well. Okay, now, let me see, make group from this generative image. Then uh, line drawing type image to color blend mode, overlay blend mode. Make group. These four layers makes this image, right? Okay, make group. Then duplicate this group. Now flatten this image. Okay, this image is base group image okay now we got the base group image pretty high contrast colors move this one up over this white layer this white layer is opacity about 60 70 all right half down now move this one this image up over this white layer then i want to show this color let me see, change blend mode to, okay, change blend mode to linear color, then uh, make mask. Now we invert this mask. Okay, now open window. Let me see, using same brush, turpentine brush, change brush, now reveal this 
mask to show same image though so it's hard to say how much we are looking at let me see Let me see if I change this white layer opacity up to max. Okay, change back to maybe easy to see this image difference. Okay, just want to see the image. Leave it this way. Then after make this window, then I'm going to change back to linear light. Let me see what's going to happen. Let me see. Now change this blend mode. Oh, I got back this one too. About 65. Then change this blend mode. Okay, it says same image over this base group image. So this layer's image is just add over this halftone image. So it goes darken because showing no more image. So in this case, I'm going to mask this. Same brush. Show her more clear than the uh, hide background. So in this case, she's the more darker image. Because of this mask, right? Okay. Why? Opacity back to max. Well, bring it to 50. Half tone. Okay. We are looking at this image already. So, I'm going to fix this white layer. Let me see, clear this white layer, then show the background guys a little bit more. Yeah, then going be the second reading, much, not much important background, show some using this mask to show her more clear okay now this mask is for her main subject then this one is white layer second reading for background guys a little bit showing so Opacity is a little bit more up, maybe 70%. We see some background. Okay, then, okay, she's gonna be clear, right? Show more nice, clear image. Okay, about this. Hide this guys just a touch more. Okay. Now let's see. This is base group image. Okay, I just wanna see let's see about this image. We not we are just looking at her. Only for her. Then maybe though this is the guys. Okay, about this image. Okay, duplicate this base image. Then I want to smudge this. Turn off this base image. Just keep it. Just in case. Then uh, 
This is the base image. I'm gonna smudge using Evolve. Hmm. Won't show much difference, huh? Because this overlay effect shows more. It's gonna help this image. Okay, in this case, let me see if I move this smudge image. Just undo this white layer. Okay, then continue to smudge first. We don't see the image much. Okay, then especially this old man, we don't see, huh? So let me see. Turn on this base image. Okay, how about this? Now it's this uh, straight image, base group image, is half tone, about 70% opacity with this mask. Then white layer is again 70%. Then this smashed image is max. Okay. Let's see about this smudged image. I'm gonna continue to smudge again just to touch more. Okay, that's good. Now, about this mask, it's gonna show some smudged image. Now tone down this smudged image. Okay, keep it 70%. Opacity is everything 70%. No, easy, easy to remember. So, okay, then I'm gonna add gradation colors over this image. Add mask. Invert this mask. Now open this gradation colors little hole. Wade, let's see, evolve. Okay, let me see, add color. Change brush to soft brush. Then turn off this mask and this image. Now we see the color as well. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna add fix this window. this color so just duplicate then change blend mode to color burn just emphasize okay now some of masks I'm gonna fix this just to touch add Dark on some face, then hide these dark lines, then I want to add some catch light though, just for catch light, well, leave it soft brush. Yeah, 
do the more dark than this say so we're gonna fix some more sharp and clear image okay now what else okay now i want to make okay same eyes the year not only eyes that's just color normal blend mode because i want to add white surrounding so use evolve white ray frame group image then flatten this image then I smudged like so you see the background then add white layer with mask this mask is turpentine texture brush this is for mm, background then again add base group image with mask only for woman so more clear then add gradation colors two layers one is normal real saddle color then darken colors duplicate same image same color change blend mode to linear burn same mask to darken so much then line drawing type image without her face so outlines of the instruments outside then white frame over this well that's it for today and uh, kind of complicated I gotta again look back and uh, study some method new one try to get something interesting image not completed yet still need to study all right thank you for watching my video and uh, i really appreciate for you guys support and uh, i hope you're gonna get you're gonna find some idea for your creative work and uh, you guys have a nice day and thank you. See you next time. Bye now. Ciao. Good day.